fact, in this last demo, we are going to review together Azure Virtual uh, Tap. So I have a virtual network here. I have different domain controllers, and I have the VTAP enabled on 10.1.2.6. So in order to configure that, I had to previously create using CLI uh, this tap. So here, you can see that I can create on this virtual NIC VTAP uh, a tap resource. I can check this configuration by the CLI command, and I can see that actually I will tap all uh, the traffic. I will send that on port 4789, and this machine will be uh, the destination of uh, the tap. Next step is to link virtual machines to this tap. So here you can see that on all this series of commands, I am actually linking the VM uh, DC01 uh, with the uh, NIC CDC01480, and now this is tapped. So then I go to this VTAP machine, I go via Shark, uh, which I run, and I'm going to be able to see that actually I see a lot of traffic. So there's obviously my uh, RDP traffic. But if interestingly enough I tap VXLAN, you will see that actually I have a lot of traffic too. And if you zoom in a little bit into this uh, traffic to understand what it is, you see that this is actually the traffic of my domain controller of DC01 that you see and that is here um, talking to other machines. And interestingly, as you mentioned, this is VXLAN encapsulation. So you see here that this uh, machine, this is a discussion with 10.1.2.4, this is 01. And I can see uh, here the traffic and I can apply some intelligent and some filtering. So in this example, I just took Wireshark for a very simple example of showing you that I'm able to tap and see the traffic of this VM, but you can guess with any additional third party that do network monitoring, network analytics, the possibilities are just endless for you to monitor what's happening inside your VM.